For another example, we have v minus 4 over 4 minus 3. For the first step, you have to factor the numerator and the denominator. So in this case, Notice that you can actually factor out something in the denominator. You can actually get the negative 1 as the common factor in the denominator. So it would now turn into negative 1 times the quantity of negative 4 plus d. Then to get the restricted value, you have to equate it into 0. So negative 4 plus d is not equal to 0. So since we are solving for the restricted value of d, apply addition property of equality. So add positive 4 to both sides. This would give us v is not equal to positive 4. And that would give us the restricted value. So set of v such that v is not equal to positive 4. Now, for the cancellation or division of any common factors, this is what will happen. The negative 4 plus d in the parentheses on step 1 can actually be rewritten as d minus 4. The sign for each term remains the same. 4 is still negative and d is still positive. Notice that you can actually cancel the d minus 4. So upon canceling, we now have 1 in the numerator and the negative 1 in the denominator. The simplest form of that would simply be negative 1. Now, open your Schoology and try to simplify the following rational expressions. 